irritating and inhumane. That's how several people living near a northeast Portland Fred Meyer described the music coming from loudspeakers in the parking lot. The grocery chain admits it recently started playing classical music to discourage illegal activity overnight. Alma McCarty heard the complaints from neighbors. Alma. It's not the first time Portlanders have heard of a similar tactic. In 2019, KGW reported on a 7-Eleven downtown that played a high pitch piercing tone. The owners were stopped by the city since the noise registered at more than twice the legal limit. Tonight's story is is different. This is classical music, but to neighbors nearby, it's an ongoing nuisance and they just want it to stop. Whether you're around the corner, it does wake me up or directly across the street. It starts at about 10 o'clock. Many living nearby the Gateway Fred Meyer on 102nd Avenue in Northeast Portland share the same thoughts about this. <laughs> It's the equivalent of torture. This is what they use in enhanced interrogation techniques and what North Korea uses on the border to uh, psychologically torment the, the troops to the south. I first heard it actually about four months ago. Um, and we all heard it really loud and all my neighbors were like, what is that sound? What is that music? Classical music coming from these speakers late at night. Fred Meyer confirms it's a deterrent. A spokesperson for the company tells KGW News, our goal is to maintain a safe community in and around our stores at all times. We have recently started playing classical music outside select stores, which is intended to be a neighborhood friendly way to discourage illegal or unsafe activities. This is not a community friendly uh, exercise if you ask me. Uh, I don't think it's helping uh, to solve any problems whatsoever with homelessness. I think it is inhumane, cruel, and they should be ashamed. Paul, who lives in the apartments facing this select store, shot this video to show just how loud the sound can be. I have neighbors uh, who are being awakened by this. It disturbs me greatly. He's called the store and even the surveillance company supplying these devices. But the music continues despite these conversations. A different person said that it, it was uh, there to deter homelessness and drug use. And it's irritating them. It's their it's like they're, they know they're irritating everybody else in the neighborhood and it's like they don't care. Um, I've contacted them. They haven't responded. They haven't said anything. Christopher Welsh doesn't hear the music all the time, living a bit further away. But when he has, he's also called PPB. There hasn't been a solution at all. Um, and it's a repeated thing that just keeps happening. Portland police reported seven disturbance calls since October 17th to this location, all related, they say, to loud music. However, PPB doesn't generally enforce noise complaints, citing the calls as lower priority plus insufficient staffing to respond. Well, just the little bit we heard could be <laughs> deemed a little bit annoying. A little Thank bit. you, Alma.